say, darling, cause you'll fake it. Don't hide the tears, cause I know you're breaking. All this love and all this pain you've given. All this love and all. This is me and today I am vlogging for you guys. So, so far I've just got ready for the day. Also, I don't know if you've noticed, but I've recently redecorated my room. Now I've got a little bit more time now. I've finished my A-levels and it's the summer and things. So that's quite fun. So if you'd like to see a room tour, then be sure to comment down below. Because it is a slightly like non-horsey video, but I know a lot of you guys might find that quite interesting. Also, I've got my bright orange top on today because I'm taking Casper for a hack across the fields and the hills and things and I like to wear sort of really bright colours when I go for a hack just so then if there's any general public with like dogs and dog walkers and things they can see us when we're galloping by and we're not gonna um, get any in anybody's way kind of thing so now I'm all ready I'm gonna go down to the horses give them some food and get everything ready for getting Casper in the van and going for a ride So I'm just getting Casper's saddle all ready for our ride. I'm going to be using his jump saddle today. And I've also got his new horse hood saddle pad on that was kindly gifted to us. And I love the look like orange on it. I like how it's bright but then not too bright. And also this matches really well my high vis which is orange from the Brick Charity for the My Hackathon. So also tracking our miles for our 100 miles for Brick. And from in here, I need to grab his little matching ear bonnets. The flies are really out at the moment, so hopefully that will help the flies not going in his ears and things. And it's like this special long one, so I can like attach this to his nose band so it doesn't get flappy, especially when it's windy and things. So pop that down. Also need to grab my gloves. Oh yeah, sorry guys, it's a little bit messy in here. Just grab my grey ones, and I think that's it for in here. And then I'll also just grab his um, boots. I usually like using these ones when hacking, especially as last time I took him on a hack, we went through some brambles and um, they got a little bit cut up, which is kind of sad because I love using these for like training and things. So I'll just grab these and the back boots as well. And of course, I need to grab his bridle. I'm just going to be taking his Pierce of Sweden one today. Just because um, I'm worried he might be a little bit spicy because I haven't taken him out on the hills for a while. And he always loves going on big gallops there. And there's a lot of like dog walkers and things. So uh, we're just going to be using this guy today. And of course, I need to catch Casper. So I've just got his head collar here. An orange matchy lead rope, of course. So I'm going to go grab him, give him a groom. And then I will see you on the hills.
much deeper I will shout. Okay, everybody, we are now back at home. Casper's had a nice wash off because he got very sweaty on our ride. We both had so much fun as well. I think we did about six miles, so we went quite a distance. Um, I think it took us about an hour and a half. We did stop for like photos and things, and it was really hilly as well. So it was really good for Casper and getting both of our fitness up ready for the summer. Well, it was kind of the summer now, but just get us a bit fitter after his and our little break when I've had my A levels. So now I'm going to grab my saddle and do a bit of tack cleaning because my saddle and my boots both need sort of a good deep clean and also a nice condition so let's get cleaning <laughs> saddle is now nice and clean I now need to clean my boots and put them back in the little boot bag I've also got these little boot trees there just to make sure that they don't get all wrinkly when they stand up like that if not they're kind of floppy <laughs> so I'm gonna go give them a bit of a clean put them back in their bag and all that jazz <laughs> cleaning all of my tack, popped it away, locked up my tack room. So now I'm going to go and check up on the chickens. I also need to collect their eggs for the day and I also need to give them a bit of a clean out as well. Hey chicks, how you doing? Hello. I love the little noises they make, it's so cute. So the chickens, we actually moved them along, so they've now got a fresh bit of grass. That was sort of the old patch of grass that they were on, and they're now here. So they've really been enjoying like pecking like the flowers and the grass and things. We've got Snickers down here. Hello. You standing on the lettuce? <laughs> hey Snickers. Do you want some pellets? Yum yum. Snickers. Now the chicken's water is all nice and clean and it's really cute, they've all gone into the shade because it's quite warm and sunny today. And today we have four fresh eggs. So I've now got my marigolds on and all of my cleaning things. It's time to get this coop looking a bit nicer.
I've now just finished up cleaning out the chickens and they look so cute in the little corner they're just pecking away at some really tasty grass and bits in there I think um, Bounty at the back she just had a little lie down I think they might start making a dust bath there but I'm not sure they quite like going in the corners the chickens oh Snickers is pecking at something down there Ah, little happy chicks see you later guys <laughs>